Alrighty guys, welcome back to Zerif Plays. I know it's been a while, but we are back. Today we are playing a game called Death Bloom. This is chapter one. I think there's two chapters totally out at the moment, but today we're gonna get into the first one. So let's sit back, relax. Probably not relax, this is probably gonna be terrifying, and enjoy. Christina, five years ago. Okay. Sensitivity is absolutely through the roof. Let's, uh. Okay, we can't change anything at the moment. Damn it. Okay. Hello? Bro. So this is my grandfather's house apparently. It's always the same hallways but different rooms. How long have I been in this house? How many years? Whoa, what the fuck? Man, this is, this is, the ambience is absolutely insane. I don't know, uh... Hello? Oh my god, I didn't even notice that. What the fuck? Bro. Hello? Grandpa? Are you home? What the fuck is that? Mannequins. Ha! <laughs> but. Oh my god. Why does she do this to me? It wasn't my fault. Oh, dude. I don't think that's uh, YouTube friendly. Oh! <gasps> it's open now. Damn! Look at the assets on those mannequins. Okay. I'm distracted. Go back to. We're finding Grandpa. Grandpa! Are you... Oh! No, 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 no. Hello? Gramps? Okay. It's just titties. It's fine. How long until I die here? Or am I already dead? This house used to be full of life and hope for the future. It's really hard to see that with the state of things at the moment. Oh. I don't want to look behind me. I hate looking behind me. Oh, bro. Bro, 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 bro. Hello? Huh. Oh, shit. It's okay. That wasn't you moving, was it, Mrs. Mannequin? Bro. Instant on edge. There's no build up. This was just like, here you go. Get in this house. <gasps> Hello. F3. 
to interact or examine objects. Okay. Oh. Oh, shit. Okay, I see. Down the stairs we go. Man, the sensitivity is so high. I'm waiting for it. It's coming. up with that a bag of death bloom is on the shrine I don't feel good being in this room oh no don't turn around I have to turn around a bag of death bloom okay Maybe just leave because there doesn't seem to be anything here. <gasps> no. Oh, fuck. There's someone sitting in the chair. Hello? Death Bloom's gone. This isn't real. I need to wake up from this nightmare. She can't actually be here. We found her dead in the basement years ago. Oh no 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 no. No 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 no. Oh, oh, oh. Bro. What do I do? It wants me to walk to it. Uncalled for. Uncalled for, and to be honest, a little bit rude. Whoa. Well, this looks cool. It's a big change up from what we were just walking through. Oh man, this is great. Why can't we just stay here? My grandfather's house should be through this garden. I can't wait to see it. Oh no. So we're basically, we're on our way there. To that place we were just in. That's so messed up. Garden map. Okay. Tab to close. Okay. Okay. Barkman Garden. Alrighty. Okay, so we're at the fountain. Awesome. Looks like we need to get to that red dot. Open the gate up to the manor. And that would just be straight across that way. Wow, this is really cool. This place must be worth an absolute mint. This is like an estate. Wow. Fucking rich people vibes, god damn. It's locked. There is a set of locks to the right of the gate. Uh, 
Okay. Uh, find three keys to open the gate. Okay, so... I guess let's go and have a search. Hey, I found a saw. A key! It's inscribed Scarecrow. Okay. Over here. Yep. One grave. Oh no, there's more. I couldn't see them until the lightning. <laughs> Another key. A key, it's inscribed lion. So I've got scarecrow and lion. Alright, so let's go straight back to the fountain. What the fuck was that sound? There's the fountain. So let's go over to here, this way. <laughs> oh shit. someone living in there? Fuck. There's the key. Tin man. Oh no, 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 no. I hate turning around in fucking horror games, dude. Let's just pace it all the way back to the gate. Alright, so we've got Scarecrow, Lion, and Tin Man. Why were they named? It didn't even matter. I thought I would have to actually put it into some, like, specific combination or, like, you know, in sequence. But, okay. Hey, I'm not complaining. Made it easy for me. Oh, Grandpa's house. Could you just imagine, like, having, like, a family member that owns this? Like, that, that's crazy, dude. My god damn. Front door is locked. My grandfather should have brought a home security system instead of hiding keys all over the place. Under the rug? No? Okay. Okay, let's go have a little bit of a look around this way. Might have to get into a back entrance or something. A flashlight would be amazing right now. House key? Front door key. Alright. We are finally going in. I unlocked it with the front door key. Oh damn. Flashlight, hell yes. Which is bad because it means it's going to be fucking pitch black in there. 
I swear that door handle just moved. <gasps> it did. Home sweet home. Oh god. Hello. Barkman Manor main area. This place is incredible. I had no idea anyone in our family was wealthy. Looking from the garden, this place must have dozens of rooms. I should find a way to turn the power back on. Trying to navigate this place in the dark will just lead me getting lost. Yeah. No shit. Tea to toggle flashlight on and off. Why would I want to do that? Power. I don't have a map for this area. Okay. Before we go up, let's just go straight. Hello? It's locked. Of course it is. I don't know why I expected anything different. Alright, well let's start with this way. <sighs> okay. Hello? Hey, it's Grandpa! Hey, Grandpa! Grandma? Damn! Whew. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I missed this key. Basement key. Which wouldn't be this. This would be the attic, wouldn't it? Yeah, I thought so. So I have to go back, I think, and then down straight like I originally was. Those candles were lit. I hope no one is squatting in my grandfather's house. What candles? Fuck! I didn't even think about that. Okay, basement. Those candles are lit too now. Oh, loading, thank god. I need to recollect. <laughs> Shit puts you so on edge, bro. Okay. Twisty staircase. The fuck is that? Hello? Oh, a map. A homemade map. What the hell? Dude! Okay. So where I entered and then left is the power room from that. That would be that way. What's this? Journal of Edmund G. No date. 9pm. I took Marcus to the basement. I don't think it's safe in the house anymore. Edna told me that there was a path underground that led to the forest outside some kind of old prohibition tunnel we could take to get away from here the rest of the journal is torn damn bro all right let's go to the power room i guess oh of course this one will probably be locked <laughs>
What the fuck just happened? It looks like a power lock is activated when it's closed. I'm trapped. I am trapped. That's flooded, so I can't go there. It's going to close behind me. No turning back now, I guess. That alarm I set off locked the doors. I need to get the power back on and find a way to release the locks from within the base. Okay. Since the alarm and the lights are on, there must be a backup generator running. At least that's good news. I might be overthinking things, but I've never seen a security system work like that before. It wouldn't stop anyone from breaking in, but instead stop someone from breaking out. Once they're already inside. Maybe it was installed wrong? <laughs> Bro! <laughs> oh, maybe it was installed wrong. Hello? Oh my god, this is fucked. What the fuck was that? Oh, map updated. Oh my god. I need to find four fuel tanks to drain the water and any kind of way to get the power on. Oh shit, okay, so I need to find like pipes or something or, or f tanks of some kind. So maybe all the pipes are down or tanks are down these ways. Bro, I'm telling you right now, this sucks. This sucks so bad. Oh shit, dude. That's a dude. That's a dude. Someone's in my grandpa's house. Bro, what is that sound? Are you serious? Eleven PM. I wandered through the dark, but everything was sealed off from what I saw. It's so easy to get turned around in this place. I started drawing the corridors and rooms to help uh, from getting lost, and hopefully find the tunnel out of here. I told Marcus to stay uh, outside one of the rooms, but he burst crying. He said he heard someone in the dark. My son has always been anxious about the dark, and I'm sure a place like this isn't exactly fun for him. Yeah, fair enough too, dude. So. I'm very concerned now. I've got given a knife. So I'm guessing that means I can defend myself from enemies, but I'm and block. But I don't like that. I, I kind of like it, but I kind of don't. Oh. <gasps> That means he's free, restricted area, authorized personnel only. What the fuck? We're in a fucking mansion, a manor. Oh. It's too deep in the table to pull it out. Come on, man. Really?
Hello? Edmund G. 1.36am. I think I understand why this area is restricted. There are rooms down here I never knew of. Those people never left in the night. I need to get my son to the forest as soon as possible and call the police. Maybe he could squeeze through the bars, but I don't know if it's the right direction. Marcus is always looking behind himself every few minutes. He confessed to me that the other children of the congregation told him that there are cannibals that live in this basement, and that's why the old bunker system was abandoned. I think this story mixed with the dark is making his imagination run wild. <sighs> Bro. I can tell you right now, the kid's onto something. He knows. He knows. The fuck? Is a room like this doing any? It's a fucking morgue. I found a fuel canister. Sweet. I don't know what that means. What was the old sound? What does that mean? Oh, fuck. The axe is gone, bro. That's not good. I'm bringing a knife to an axe fight. Can I have a gun? <sighs> Anxiety's getting to me. It's getting to me. But we'll push forward. We'll push forward. Alright. So this must be the only two tanks here, on this side. And then the other two must be the other way. I just don't understand what this knife is going to do against a dude with an axe. He's got way more reach. Maybe there's a uh, tank in here? Come on, man. I don't want to be here anymore. Screw this house. Grandpa can keep it. Fucking comes with all these additional features, like... May include ghost hauntings. And you might be subject to... Cannibals running around with axes. Hi. Don't mind me, bro. Is he jumping in the water? What the fuck? <laughs> Don't mind me. I'm just, um... You know this is my house, right? Oh, that scared the living fuck out of me. What the fuck? Whoever chose the layout of this. Is a douche. This was 
created as a puzzle to track where someone would go. I should just leave this house as soon as I disengage the lock on the exit. Yeah, no shit. Someone's trapped just here, bruh. It's probably fucking grandpa. What are these things? Why would it be in a basement? Because someone's a f fucking sicko. Still has power. Press F to flip. Did that do it? It wasn't. Oh, oh, no, no. Bro, I'm going to get jumped. This is it. I'm going to get jumped. God. Please, no. Come on. Are you fucking kidding me? Come on, bitch! Oh, fuck that. Yeah, fuck that. <laughs> what the actual fuck is this game, dude? This is messed up. This isn't a basement, it's more like a network of expansive tunnels. What was being built down here? A fucking dungeon, bro. A fucking torture cell. To fucking keep people in and harvest their fucking organs.